In the mid-19th century, the world was shrinking. Steamships and railways were connecting continents like never before. But this new interconnectedness came with a terrifying, unseen price. Today, we're talking about the forgotten killer of 1865, a cholera outbreak that exploded along the Suez Canal, claiming over 30,000 lives in just a matter of weeks. This wasn't just any outbreak, it was a flashpoint in the fourth global cholera pandemic. A wave of disease that swept out of India in 1863. By 1865, the Suez Canal was a bustling construction zone, a massive project employing tens of thousands of workers from across Europe and North Africa. They lived in crowded, unsanitary camps, a perfect breeding ground for disease. The spark that lit this powder keg likely arrived with Muslim pilgrims returning from Mecca, where an outbreak was already raging. In March of 1865, the first cases appeared among the canal workers. The disease spread like wildfire. Cholera is a brutal and swift illness. Victims would be healthy one moment and, within hours, suffer from severe dehydration, leading to shock and death sometimes in less than a day. Panic gripped the region. The construction camps became death traps. People fled in every direction, but they couldn't outrun the bacteria. The outbreak followed the flow of human traffic, moving from the canal zone to major Egyptian cities like Alexandria and Cairo. The death toll was staggering. In Alexandria alone, hundreds died each day at the peak of the crisis. Official records say over 30,000 perished, but the true number is likely much higher. This devastating event served as a horrifying lesson. It showed just how quickly a localized outbreak could become an international crisis in the modern, connected world. The Suez Canal, a symbol of progress, had inadvertently become a superhighway for a pandemic. It forced nations to rethink public health and led to the first international sanitary conferences. Early attempts to coordinate a global response to disease. It is a stark reminder that the challenges of global health we face today have deep roots in our shared history. Thanks for watching. If you found this piece of forgotten history interesting, please like this video and subscribe for more stories you might have missed. See you next time.